Well, I get rain today. It's very possible. Most Belgian. Today is uh, the day after the national championships. It seems like the winter is coming. And what goes up, must come down. really nice weather and it usually isn't so I'm happy with that so let's hear from him what he thinks Oh. Hot? Oh, that was five times the famous local climb for Anafjala. It's, uh, it's actually my favorite climb here to go through the races. For races. And, uh, because it's so hard, it's like 2k and with 10% average, it's not a huge climb, but it makes for some uh, some uh, pain in the legs. That's what I need. Pain in the legs. Pain in the legs. Now it's three days to the next race in Italy. I'll have a bunch of races done there this time, so hope today's session was uh, the dot over the eye. Travel day today. A quick morning ride before uh, traveling this afternoon to Italy to do some uh, 
racing again what do they say the show must go on Ten days since the last time we were here. Actually, we were hoping for a, a bus this time, right? Fast, uh, quite fast. But in the middle, uh, we had the national championship. We were not at home to do nothing. Yeah, that's right. What I meant was the bus. We have still the camper. The bus is a little more comfortable, but this will have to do. It's a long uh, way for the bus to get down to Italy. In uh, a city called Pascara. Tomorrow we have a race, Trofeo Matteotti. And uh, Sunday we have another race, Memorial Marco Pantani. And then another race next week. So, uh, there will be plenty of racing here in Italy this time also. The rest of the team will come. Now it's only me and Simone. A long travel yesterday and another long travel today. <sighs> yes, we're here in uh, what's the what's the name of the sea here? Adriatic Sea. Mare Adriatico. Yeah, the Adriatic Sea, the coast uh, of Italy close to Croatia yes yes on the other side there's uh, Croatia I think so I'm not sure yeah I'm pretty sure that's <laughs> Croatia <laughs> but uh, yeah I think uh, I think tomorrow we have a race and uh, this is the pre-race ride the ride we always have before the race to spin the legs And uh, we feel ready. Charging the batteries with the blue ocean. That's smart. Very smart. Uh, no, but I mean, what did you just say? The sea here is not the best in Italy. It's not the best in Italy, yes. Because the most beautiful sea is in uh, Tirreno. Where uh, in Tuscany or uh, in Sardinia, for example. Yeah? Yes. And Sardinia, but that's an island. Yes, but there are uh, the best sea of yeah, Italy. Yeah, yeah. So next, the, I heard we maybe do a race in uh, Sardinia at the end of the year. Maybe. We hope so. It's perfect. Yeah. We can finish uh, the season here with a good race, and then uh, we can stay here uh, for a holiday. Yeah, but let's not think too much about the holiday. No, it's not the time. We have to a race to win tomorrow, it. and uh, the day after, and the day after. There is rest, yeah. But then the rest of the next week. And then we have uh, to do a stage race and we have to do really well. Yeah. yeah, we have work to do. We need a win soon. We really do. I'm agree with you. What? I'm agree. I agree. Uh, you agree, yeah. I'm agree with you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So we leave at 9. I think so. Yeah, oh. we do. Yes. <laughs> so, Alexander Evans is making his bag ready. I've been ready for a long time. But he's yeah, slow. I like to get up a bit later. Yeah. Laying in, laying in bed on TikTok for at least 15 minutes extra. That's it. Enjoy my mornings. Yeah. Mm. This coffee is not yet empty. So hurry up, man. Yeah, I'm on that. Skål. No, skål. 
It's cold. <laughs> then we have to do like this. It's cold. But with the coffee, it's not. Uh... <laughs> no, it's not tradition. No. Free rice coffee. Woohoo! <laughs> Another race done and dusted. Simone here is uh, spending this time uh, watching uh, Tour de France. Tour de France, yeah. Now we have a seven hour transfer. No, no, what did I say? No, no. Three hours. Three hours. Three yeah. hours 30. Three hours 30, that's right. And uh, the Australian is just finished uh, listening to my talk about. Uh, Am I uh, complaining about the uh, hot weather? Yeah, and the geography. Yeah, and the geography of why it's so cold in Norway. Yeah. At the moment, I had uh, all last week, uh, oh, this week, as a preparation for this race, I rode in 10 degrees every day. And here today it was 36. 36, right? Yeah, 36. And with a humidity of 200%. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it was incredible. Yeah. And it, yeah. Slightly better preparation in Girona. Yeah. I started at 32 degrees. So I can't complain too much. Yeah, that's basically 36. So you were yeah. actually, you were perfectly uh, uh, acclimatized. 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 Yes, that's what I was. The word I was searching for. Yeah. Anyway, tomorrow's another race. We hope for better. Uh, better results.